Wigtypes.com. I believe she was like $15 or so. I'm not exactly sure, but I will leave all that information in the description box below. I got her in the shade 1B. So I'm going to go ahead and take my scarf off for you guys. And if you're interested in seeing how my hair is growing out, I will be doing another two-week update to show you how my hair is growing out. And we're going to go ahead and get her out of the box. I got her today in the mail and I was so excited because I have been watching for her. And she finally arrived today. So, let's see. And in case you're wondering, this is a 100% human hair unit. So she looks like this, just fresh out the pack. Going to go ahead and take that mesh cap off. Just stuffing out. And you cut the little tags off. Now I do have a small head fairly small head so on most of my units or should I say on all of them that I purchase I pretty much have to take the adjustable straps and overlap them in the back just so it will lay on my neck so just like any other standard wig cap it has your comb in the nape area your comb in the temp in the forehead excuse me and then your adjustable straps so what I'm going to do now, I'm going to go ahead and just take the adjustable straps and bring them in as close as I can. Because I already know um, if I try it on just as the wig, as the adjustable straps are, it's going to be too big. So we're going to go ahead and just bring them close to one another. So as you can see, they're touching right there. One to another, and we're gonna go ahead and try this baby on. Okay, now, uh, rah, <laughs> uh, rah, uh, rah. <laughs> whoa. Fresh out the pack, this baby does look like a hat. I'm not going to lie. But it has potential. So, I mean, for me, for my taste, what I'm going to do, I'm going to take some clippers and I'm going to take all this down to make it closer to my nape. And I'm also going to clean it up around my ears. But other than that, um, you do have a little to play with here in the front so I'm looking over here to my right because my mirror is right there so excuse me for looking off camera but um yeah this baby is hot yeah she's a cutie and what I like about it is for the fact that it's so short that it looks like a natural your haircut so I'm just kind of just Going with my fingers different ways to see what kind of look I could come up with or what's. And it is like I, I sell one, a number one. So it's jet black. And yeah, you can't do too much to it. But for my liking to try to make it look even more natural, 
I'm gonna clean it up around my ears probably I don't know if I'm gonna mess with these um, side pieces a little bit because that does give me a little something to play with so I don't think I'm gonna touch that but back here I don't know if you can see I'm gonna try to turn around and let you get a look see here all of this extraness I want to take it in a little closer a lot closer so it lays a lot flatter but other than that I mean this baby is really cute you can do a few little um, points on it if you like that straight look I don't know um, pretty much anything else that you can do with it but yeah this is her spring and summertime so I would definitely advise you not to sleep on this baby because she is very cute it's a very hot unit I've been wearing it for maybe about a week now and I've gotten numerous compliments on the unit so I would definitely tell you to pick it up it's very affordable it's only I believe like 16 to 18 dollars I would say and then shipping was about seven to eight dollars so total I paid 20 25 dollars for the unit so it's definitely a must get you do need to have this one in your collection i mean for twenty dollars a human hair wig you definitely cannot beat that price so i'm gonna go ahead and do a 360 and let you take a look at the unit once again i hope you guys enjoy have a great day bye bye <laughs> Wow, wow, wow.